Sanctum is a first-person shooter tower defense video game, developed by independent developer Coffee Stain Studios. It has been available for pre-purchase via Steam for Microsoft Windows since 24 March 2011. The successor, Sanctum 2, was announced in 2012 and released in May 2013. Topic. Plot In Sanctum, players take on the role of Sky, an elite soldier sent out to protect her hometown, Elysian 1, from hordes of mysterious alien creatures. To be successful in the task, the player will have to defend a core on each level. To accomplish this, the player builds defensive structures, and assists their structures by fending off the enemies themselves. Gameplay The gameplay in Sanctum can be divided into the building phase and the extermination phase. In the building phase, the player builds structures on a predefined grid, using the eight towers chosen at the start of the level. These towers include stationary weapons, teleporters for the player's use, and pads that affect enemies moving over them. The player can also upgrade any of the three weapons equipped at the start. Building and upgrading both cost points, which are gained when enemies are killed. In the extermination phase, a wave of one or more enemy types moves across the level towards the core. With each enemy that reaches the core, the condition of the core degrades from 100%. When the condition reaches 0%, the game ends. Unlike most tower defense games, the player is allowed to move about the level during this phase and attack enemies with different weapon types, much like in a typical first-person shooter. Touching enemies will result in the player being knocked back, but no damage is done. There are ten types of enemies in the game, three of which are airborne. Because certain towers are more effective against certain enemies, and only a select few towers affect flying enemies, the player must plan for all possibilities when building defenses. To aid the player in this, information about upcoming waves is shown in the pause menu, as well as descriptions of the various enemies, towers, and weapons. Enemies. This game has a wide range of enemies to fend off from the core. Each enemy has strengths and weaknesses. Some enemies are immune to certain towers while some are very vulnerable. For example, a flying enemy such as a spore pod will not take any damage from a gatling gun. Also, some enemies are slow while some are very fast. For example, the runners are small and fast while the soakers can withstand a lot of damage but are slow. Other enemies include the walker, bobblehead, hoverer, and tank. Topic. Development The beta was made available to all people who pre-purchased the game on Steam. The beta only allowed players to play one map in both single-player and multiplayer. Topic. Reception Sanctum received mixed reviews from critics. The review aggregation website Metacritic currently estimates a score of 70 out of 100, based on 22 reviews.